Anthony Albanese, um, the whole question, I mean, the Labor Party is buying into the tax cutting thing because you actually upped the ante um, in a sort of Dutch auction on budget night um, or a couple of days after the budget uh, by suggesting a 5% small business tax cut. So um, I guess you must agree that cutting tax is good. Well, tax is now higher at 22.3% than it was under the former Labor government. Spending is as high as it was at the peak of the global financial crisis when we had the economic stimulus plan. That was a good thing. Uh, I think that, of course, uh, taxes should be lower if possible, but we need to make sure that the tax system is progressive, that it's efficient, and that those who can afford to pay uh, do indeed pay, and that those that should be paying, such as the measure that we have for, to uh, deal with multinational tax avoidance, $2 billion over the forwards, $7 billion over 10 years. That's a practical suggestion that we've put forward to increase the tax base, to maintain its progressivity. I mean, Judith raised the issue of the tax-free threshold. I'm very proud that we took a million Australians who are at the poorest level out of the tax system. I'm very proud of that. Uh, that increased their living standards to those who most needed it. And a more equal society is actually good economics as okay. well. Let, let me because just ask they you... spend their money on purchasing and creating jobs. Quick, quick, uh, quick answer to this if you can. Do you seriously think you can reinstate the Gonski uh, funding for education, pay the full cost of NDIS and give a 5% tax cut to 2 million small businesses and not raise big taxes somewhere else? Well, I've already said that we have, we have $20 billion of revenue measures on the table between the multinational uh, tax measures and superannuation changes. Now, there's been some criticism of us for that, but I think we as an opposition, uh, halfway through the term, deserve credit for putting those practical suggestions out there, and uh, the government can take it up any time they like.